get back to the rod and we're on and it's taken a lot of line a lot of line Morning, day three. It's a beautiful day. Um, there is a storm on the way, but I think it's gonna miss us probably, hopefully, we'll find out. Let's get down to the water and uh, start some fishing. We've got some yabbies, hopefully get some brim. We'll chuck a big brim fill it out now, try and get some more shark bait, and hopefully drop the shark rods a bit later. Fish, <coughs> first of the day, that feels on and well hooked. He ran pretty hard, but I don't think that means too much. Drag him up through that shit, up through that shit, up through that shit. Come on, buddy. He's no 43, that's for sure. No bloody 43. Bit under legal, I reckon. We'll toss that one back and get straight back out there. Another fish. I'd say a brim. They come out in the morning, say, so you pretty much just gotta catch your legal fish of a morning and then for the rest of the day it's just quiet as until night time you might get a bit of action um, in winter here the whiting and the flathead are just MIA they're just not out oh yes yes fish fucking oath on yabby I've casted this out halfway to fucking Russell and we've picked up a fish the drag is as you can hear pretty sandy one of those fucking mega yachts cruised through before and took out my rod and so it ended up in the drink so gonna have to give that a bit of a wash later this is not a half bad fish actually if it's a brim i think it'll be legal like i said i casted this a fair way so oh yeah looks a decent brim looks an all right fish uh, oh we'd be bloody close right oh team he went 25 on the dot so we will keep him for a future bait source Fish. It's not a half bad one. He's not massive. But he's no shocker. Come on in, Dad. Keep coming. Oh, yeah, he's swimming right down that way. I swear if he tangles that line, I'm not going to be a happy man. That's the weirdest drag noise. Because <laughs> there's so much fucking water, so much sand in this reel now. But it's still working just fine, I guess. So, can't complain. This is, I think it's an ice brim. That's, that's actually, you know what? That drag is like that on purpose. I want it to be like that. He has absolutely gone and fucking tangled this. Like a giant piece of shit. Come here. Oh, yo, he's a nice fish. Yeah, he's a good brim. Let's see if we can come under this. Absolutely. There's a brim for you. Come on, mate. Nice. He'd go 30. No worries at all. And again, and again, we've put on a bigger sinker and we're just casting it into this fucking shadow realm. And that's clearly what's working for us here, guys. These deep, deep casts. That feels a pretty nice one, too. Jeez, this reel, I tell ya. At least it's still, it's still like pulling string easy, so that's good. Look at all these fish jumping around. There must be something out there chasing them. Can't be very big. They're about to run into a brim as well. It could well just be a brim chasing them, honestly. What do we got there? Another nice brim? You bet. Yeah, they're hanging out in the deep water of the brim today. It's a nice one. Another nice one. <sighs> well, guess what happened to me? You can probably guess my fucking mattress deflated again. That's three in a row. I can't believe it. It can't be a big hole because... It's still, it's staying up reasonably well here, but at the same time, I mean, a hole's a hole. Get back to the rod, and we're on, and it's taken a lot of line, a lot of line. Of course, I didn't stop to think that I wouldn't hear the drag, but that's a fish on brim. 
This is eaten brim and a big chunk too, not a small chunk. God knows how long it's run for. God knows how puffed out he is. I'm not sure what it's fighting like. He's run a fair way. He's a fair way out there. Look how much line's left on this spool. He's taken a shit ton of line and then I think just tired himself out. Thankfully, we came back down when we did. If we'd stayed up much longer, I don't think we'd be winding this in right now. He's all right. He's not small. I don't know what it is. It's definitely not a pike eel. I think it might be a catfish even. I'm really not sure. Really not sure, guys. It's, it's gonna be fish of the day. There's no question about that. Let's just hope that hook stays in. I've really gotta hope that hook stays in. He's not running at all now. Maybe it is just a nice brim. We've been winding, he hasn't taken any line. We've been winding for a while. This fish, clearly when he picked it up, decided that he was fucking Gornski. He ran a long ass way out there. Is that our sinker? It is, that's not good. That's not what we want. Uh, I don't think it'd be a stingray. I'm t like, it was a pretty big piece of flesh. I was going for another pike here with this. That head shake there reminds me of a catfish though. Now he's swimming down that way. He is swimming against the tide, so this is an interesting one. Keen as to see what this is. Even if this is a brim, this should at least touch 35, so I'll send that sinker back down. Oh, he wants to run a little bit. Hey, oh, our drag's nearly making the right noise again. That's good. I'm worried about that sinker shaking the hook out, but the risk you take when you use a running sinker. Oh, he's just down here. He's not far away. There we go. Sinker's gone down to him. Could be a shoveler. Could be a shoveler. It's kind of fighting like a shoveler. Shovel knows it eat brim, surely. We well, can't be too far away, guys. He's fucking heavy. He doesn't want to come in. Good, good little fight on the three pound. I would have been interested to hook this after its first run. That's a bunch of weed. Is that leader? Here come the jet skis. Can't tell. Oh, what is that? What is that? I have no idea what that is. Is it a tailor? Bro, I think it's a tailor. Yes, boy. We'll take that. We'll fucking take that. There's lunch. Yeah! <laughs> Fuck yeah, man. Sick. Three pound fucking tailor for you. How about that? I didn't think it would be a tailor. It wasn't running that hard, but like genuinely, he must have just sprinted across the island there and then just fucking puffed himself. That is fucking cool, man. These are meant to taste pretty good too, right? That bottom lip, just touching 49. One centimeter off a half meter tailor. That's cool. I was about to lip him then. I'm fucking glad I didn't do that. Wow, how good guys, how fucking good. This looks like a proper summer storm, honestly. This thing looks fucked. I'll be able to hear the shark ride bites, that's all good. Is the mattress deflated? No, it's not. I think we've got a mattress. Hey guys, looks like this rain's kind of set in, so we're gonna call it head to bed. Been a cracker of a day, but so wake up and do it all again tomorrow.